Today we will learn about the hybrid pi model of a bipolar junction transistor. Uh, I am not going through the basics of the bipolar junction transistor. I am going to explain just the hybrid pi model of it. So this is the uh, identical model of a bipolar junction transistor. This is base collector and emitter. Uh, I think you all may be knowing about this thing. Now the hybrid pi model of this bipolar junction transistor looks something like this. This is the base junction, this is the emitter junction and between these two junctions a resistor R pi, R pi is drawn. So this is the R pi is the resistance between base and emitter where the drop of 0.7 volt or more than that takes place and the transistor comes in the on condition. So uh, this is the another uh, thing, this is the con current control current source and it has given the value beta into IB. I will be explaining why it, it has the value beta into IB. So th th this is present between collector and emitter. So as we know Ohm's law, you know Ohm's law says that V is equal to I into R. Now this is the pace to emitter voltage. So uh, from, from Ohm's law we can say that VPE must be equal to IB into R pi. As IB current flows through the base to emitter, uh, base to emitter junction. So now here the VB can be replaced by VBE, can be replaced by VT, okay, which which approximately has the value of 26 millivolt for BZT transistor, okay. So it can be replaced by VT because uh, they have the almost same characteristics. I can say like that, okay. So uh, now we get the formula for r pi as vt upon ibq why i have written q q is the q point value of ib okay so now this is the first formula this is the formula for r pi you should note it down the value of vt is 26 millivolt so now i will be moving forward towards gm now uh, we know we have written beta into IB as uh, the value of this current source because we know BJT is a current control voltage source. BJT, BJT is a current controlled voltage source. Uh, and we know we also have the formula IC is equal to beta into ib so this beta into ib is nothing but ic okay are you getting it so this uh gm 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 is the transconductance gm is the transconductance you know transconductance the conductance of the transistor it is opposite to the resistance okay so we know resistance has has the formula uh, v upon i so transconductance will be having formula i upon v so the formula of gm is icq upon vt this is the formula for gm okay i i i'm not explaining the i'm not deri uh, deriving this formula i'm just writing it down for the numerical solving purpose so now we can observe that ic is equal to beta into ib so we can say that beta is ic upon ib that's obvious so we have these two formulae if we take the product of them then you must be observing our gm into r pi is equal to icq upon vt into vt upon ibq okay now this vt this vt gets cancelled and ic upon ib is equal to what is equal to beta therefore beta is equal to gm into r pi okay so th these are the formulae related to the small signal uh, that is the hybrid pi model you should take a, you should take consideration this formula you should take into consideration and with the use of this formula we will be solving the MCQs.